By analyzing karyotypes, scientists are able to determine or predict genetic disorders that may affect or impact the individual. So let's take a look at our first one, which is Down syndrome, and it's also known as trisomy 21. And remember, tri stands for the number three, and we'll, I'll explain it to you in a second. And so it's an additional X on the 21st chromosome pair. So instead of having that normal two, now we have three, and that's where that tri comes from. And the way biologists or scientists write it up, they write it up as 47, XX or XY plus 21. So that lets us know that instead of having our normal 46, we have 47 chromosomes, and then it's gonna be a male or female, and then they put a plus 21 to let us know on which set of chromosomes that that disorder occurs on. Now let's analyze the karyotype of an individual with Klein-Felter syndrome. And this is gonna be an additional X on the sex or the 23rd chromosome pair. So that lets us know that this is going to be sex link since it's going to be on the 23rd pair. And the way scientists write it up or would analyze it, they would say it as 47XXY plus 23. Notice that we have an additional X chromosome right here. So that gives us that 47. And that's where that XXY comes from. So that X, additional X should not be there. And then it says plus 23 right here because that lets us know that that disorder is occurring on that 23rd pair of chromosomes.